Hey guys, Starfamethes here with another episode of Crusader Kings 2 as the Petty Kingdom of Kent. So we're not at war with anyone as you can see down here. Let's get this going. Aha, that's right, we were inviting some people with claims to our core. More trusty and Munster. means we need to get a province to one of these guys how can we do that where, where are my provinces I've, I've looked at Shire right Wessex, Kent, Essex, Middlesex that's it I have a claim on the Prince Bishop of Gloucester I don't want the one for Siri. I do have this. He's got one of the Petty Kingdom of Kent. She's an imbecile. There's a known murderer. She has in the kingdom of Cornwall. If it's not pressing a war, no, I'm Devon. Most of the Valley cast spelling. Devon. Doesn't make sense. It is of the same house, but I don't know how. Okay. It's weird. Take this, and I could take these two. Is that one of our children? This one's gonna work. Kind of surprised that they'll accept this. Nuremberg. 
This is gonna be ally among the picks. That'll be very helpful. Uh, we deal with Northumbria. He must be a piece. War is all the way over there. The Ulster. Yeah, because will she get this? No, not unless it's pressed by personal war. This will be inherited by a successor. My rival. Intrigue plot. Let's kill him. Short rain because yeah. That's odd. Also, we want to go fire for Titanic order.
Oh, so this is the sun. Okay, that works. So once the leaves dies, it's gonna go down to him. And then do him right to this one. Okay, makes sense. Two martial, one plus one combat skill, church opinion, we're losing a fine. Yeah, I should have went, uh, went out with him. Opinion is terrible. Okay. And everything. Kim Slayer is big. In the afternoon, your steward comes up the, uh, on the team and explains his plan to bring in exotic goods to the realm. It's suggesting up a trade route with a foreign realm in this. However, uh, requires an expensive expedition, but it could prove quite profitable. We'll set up, we'll set up an expedition. We decided to offer this ship for our trade expedition. The harbor master shows off a large ship with a big cargo hold that would be perfect for the job, but it has quite a hefty price. Well, we are the Wicked, so we're going to play as the Wicked. We're going to hire a crew of bandits to steal the ship. Lord, it's read that you're playing a trade journey, and some priests have come to your court. They are offering some church funds for the journey if they can come with you to the foreign realm. Yes, I will, of course, honor you. We'll go on this journey together. I'm not the highest, uh, I'm not the most pious man, but I will allow the church to come with me. I'm gonna go with the laws, we can't do anything high because you don't have a legalism for it. It's time to get the expedition going for exotic goods and hopefully for profit. Let's set out for foreign lands. The Kent, yes. The priests have been giving the crew nervous glares for a couple of days now, and today I confronted you with the concerns about traveling with these and bandits. He, uh, he continues to argue that it's not a proper way to collaborate with people of this occupation. Oh well. Uh, 
I know I'm gonna lose this, but the po point was to hold him there. If I can claim it. We gain it. He loses the hard prestige. This is I become a new liege. Give him horses. We're gonna wait till his expedition's done. So I don't know if declaring war changes that. You know, it's clean, Vaslav, the cruel's face growing red with annoyance. He glares at your steward, munching the dinner with his bare hands in a barbaric way. Excuse him, he's retarded. My courier is requested to join the Knights Hospitaliter in the struggle against the infidel. Both my blessing. Good sir. You walk idly around the court of King Vlaslav when you hear a discuss discussion increasing intensity around the corner. Turn the car, you're surprised to see one of the priests from your expedition engage in a wild theological debate with a local noble. This could endanger the whole venture. Intervene with your charm and soothe the debaters. Do I want to go for Zealous? I want to. I want to see if I can get it. We're not Zealous! Damn. Negotiation between you and King uh, Yetzalov the Cruel suddenly halts when King Yetzalov the Cruel slams his fist on the table. It seems like he no longer can stand your presence in the room, and you decide he shouts, Give this coward after you. Oh, uh, we're bitter rivals. That is epic. Predictions for the failure. Try. How many men can you raise? Five thousand. Yeah.
Well, these guys are Italian. We got some French. So now what? I see Mercy is in a war. year after this. Goes down to him. That's where he should have been disinherited though. It pains me to say it, but there is a traitor in the realm. This right egg is playing your downfall. I enclose the damning evidence with this letter. Tip off the trailer just because. Northampton. Cousin somehow, okay. She's not hostile to anyone that's of significance.
Like, if she's my rival. On behalf of this good sir. You know what? I'm gonna do that. What this allows me to do is take out this plot. Declare war for Lincoln. Once we uh, she's through this. Mercia and Ormond. Going here. So he's getting messed up here pretty good. All right. Yes, so we got flanking, we're doing good here. Over there, 
they're trying to deal with their rebels. 24, 24, 24, yes! 23, yes, run, 50! So I'm really gonna take this over and then that's gonna be... That's gonna be that for Lincoln or the Countess Sigrid, the usurper. They're gonna look to engulf Mercia and then Devon and Cor Cornwall. Then Gloucester and just start our, our way up. But as we go up, we should have the Pictus King with us. Not very strong. That's why, because Northumbria is picked into uh, Pickland. So I rolled by him. Doing a good job so far. Tell it this area, and I want to be able to start moving north. We're gonna catch this one. March. Unless I can make it there in two days after March. So in 12 days I'll have the uh, of Gainsborough. Lincoln and the city of Boston. All right, guys. Well, we started our war with Lincoln. Uh, she was the Petty Queen of Hwais. After we took Wiltshire, she became Lincoln. We took the crowns from her as well. As you can see, we are the we have the Duchy Hwais, Duchy of Essex. We have the Petty King of Kent, the Duchy of Wessex, 
So we have all those things. She has Lincoln. She's our rival. So she said. So we said home with it. And we attacked her. Uh, to. And I believe it's to install someone else there. Oh, it's for this man. And then. Yeah, so he's in Somerset right now. We're going to give him Lincoln. We're going to see if he will take our vassalization after that. I want to say it's a yes, because we're negative two right now. Yeah, so I want to say it's a yes. Oh, I broke a truce with her. I think it only goes. It only goes those that are rulers, I believe. Book of Truce. Book of Truce, yeah, so it only goes with those high leaders that are around the world. But uh, thank you for joining me. Go ahead, comment, like, subscribe. Later.